Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to Call of Duty. Thanks out for the PlayStation 2. I'm Wayne, friends and come. Let's do this thing. Oh, that took two hits, didn't it? Let me, let me reload. Oh, fantastic. I killed him without even hitting the uh, tank button or shoot button. Fantastic. This is so sad. Well, it is sad in real life. Historically, this is a pretty sad moment. I mean, show the Nazis and stuff, but uh, still, uh, they're just doing it because they had to. You know, they're under a dictatorship. They had to do whatever uh, Hitler told them to do. Stuff. But uh, yeah, so war is sad. War, what is it good for? Absolutely nothing. Ah. <sighs> But still, I'm getting a good kick out of this because I'm just literally going ramble style out here and just shooting at every single one of them. It's fantastic. And they all look exactly the same. Then again, that is kind of what uh, the Nazis did. You know, the blonde hair, blue eyes thing. So, yeah. <sighs> Why do people want me to play this game? This. I would, ba I would rather be playing uh, Battlefield 2 for the Xbox original. That's a fantastic game. This game, this game is too easy, and the noise quality is, it's fantastic. I love the noise. This noise is fantastic. I mean, if I wasn't getting so many health packs, maybe this game would be a little bit challenging at best. It's a little bit challenging. But no, there's plenty of health packs. Oh, those are enemies. Fantastic. I thought they were my buddies. Wait. Well, now I definitely need a health pack. Help me, buddy. Help me. Come on. Okay, those are the good guys. With that clean water, there's no good guys or bad guys. It is people. Wait, anyway, let's just begin the battle. I know I'm talking deep philosophy here. Oh, look, I got health. Fantastic. Now I'm back in action. Dun 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 This is funny. Wow, he hit me once and didn't flinch, but I hit him once and he's dead. Oh, he's unconscious level. Oh, look, his gun has been mid-air. How does he do that? Oh, I finally died. That took you long enough. <sighs> this game is too easy. Well, it, <laughs> technically speaking, yeah, it's too easy. But, uh, yeah, I just died. Well, well that's against the point. Uh, how many times have I died in this game? Two times? And, well, I'm on level two now, so yeah. Yeah, it's still a vice. Anyway, let's just move out. <coughs> Battle. Did I mention I got this game for a dollar? Because I did. <sighs> jump and shoot. Then jump and shoot. Jump and shoot. Oh, I didn't jump that time. Shoot! Ah, oh, come on. Punch! Why is he too punching his neck? I, I didn't hit him in the neck, I hit him in the shoulder. Level. It's the same animation over and over again. This is the power to play she's into. Oh well, seal. I might as well check this at trench out, because there's probably a few enemies in here I get before I move on with my life. So my my AI buddies can proceed. Oh, there's my buddy over here. 
At least in this game, uh, your AI buddies are actually helping you. They actually do kill people in this game. Usually a lot of AI in uh, these kind of war games don't do buckets and you're expected to do everything. Yeah, I'm talking to you, Metal Bono. Your AI buddies don't do nothing. I gotta do everything in that game. Well, I guess that's the fun of it, because if the AI killed everything, would it actually be fun? It'd be realistic, but would it be fun? No. Come on. I'm reloading. Yeah, I feel. Ha! I, you forgot I got a health pack. Actually, I've got two. Ah, uh, well, Cecilia, any health pack? No? Good? Fantastic. Well, there's a towel over here, so... Maybe in this machine gun building. That's a health pack. Let me just sneak up on him. Let's just give him the little sneaky. Just gonna sneak. He doesn't see nothing. You see nothing. Nine. Nine. You saw nothing. Oh, what? He's still alive? Fantastic. You're dead. And he fell out. <laughs> From my perspective, that was pretty dramatic. Uh, dramatic, but. He just fell out of like one uh, inch off the ground. So that's that was very dramatic. He he could have died just by that fall, couldn't he? Fantastic. Well, I'm laughing too much about this game. And I guess it's time to use that health pack. Yeah, look, there's another health pack. Fantastic, full health. Oh, what the night? What the night? Oh, a headshot. Fantastic. Headshot. Oh, miss. What you talk about, Willis? Oh, that was a mine. Never mind. Oh, it could be a, a, a dive bomb from an a, a, a above airplane that just went by. Because there was a plane that went by. So it could have been for that. Could have been. Could have been, but probably not. Dead. Is there any health? <sighs> yeah, because this game is so realistic, because, uh, <clears throat> of course, in real world, there's health packs that save you from everything. Doesn't matter how badly wounded you are, that health pack is going to save you. And, of course, landmines don't do buff kiss when it comes to your health. So if you step on a landmine in real life, nothing's going to happen to you. You won't get seriously injured, you won't lose a limb. It gives a flash room, okay? It gives a flash room, according to this game at least. This is that realistic. I'm just gonna go this way, even though there's probably an enemy behind me. Shoot! And go to the lights. Oh wait, there's an enemy over here. No wait, that was just a landmine again, fantastic. You got me again, game of sense. You got me again. Is there anyone behind me? Yes there is, but it's all good guys. When that good guy's good guys, but you know what I mean. You know what I'm talking about, Willis. And another bullet. Oh, come on, I'm out. I gotta reload again. <laughs> Close range. Fantastic. 360 no scope. Oh, wait, that was not. I mean, 360 no scope. Whoa! I have no idea why I crouched, but I did. 360 no scope. Well, that wasn't 360 no scope. But you know what I'm talking about, Lewis. I could have done it, but I didn't. Oh, what else is over here? Nothing? Absolutely nothing. Fantastic. I guess they're waiting for me to go inside. Look where you're shooting. Jeez, garbage. That's not see funny. <sighs> I'm wanting out jokes, and this is not a game you should be making fun of, but technically speaking, this is a game because seriously in real life you would die instantly from a landmine if you step on it, but in this game, I think there's a flash room. You get more damage from a gunshot to the head in this game than you do with a landmine. Then again, I might be playing on easy mode or something like that. Awful. I don't know. I haven't played this game in the crowd some time. Oh wait, he's still alive? One, two, three, shoot. 
One, two, three. Shoot. Right in the butt. Can I open this? Somebody once told me the world is gonna roll me. I ain't the sharpest two in the shit. Can I get one concept? I can use a little fuel myself and we can all use a little change. Right. The phone's ringing, so you know that means time to mute my microphone. Oh, come on! Okay, yeah, they, uh, they hang up. That's fantastic. I was about to just pause, but nope. I couldn't. I'm just gonna wait and shoot. Why can't I shoot him? He's like invincible. There we go. I shot him in the butt. I should have shoot him in his head, but apparently I missed. Uh, what, what else is there? Oh. Yeah. That's a different gun. I don't want that gun. I like my old gun. Well, but I, I guess I'm good with this gun. This is a good gun. 10 out of 10 was really get this gun in your life. Nah, oh, no, just kidding. I, I don't collect the World War II stuff. But actually, fun fact my father actually collects a lot of uh, Civil War stuff. I'm not too much into that Civil War stuff, but, uh, yeah. That's a fun fact. Wait, anyway, I uh, tear down the Nazi flag, so how do I do it? Do I just click on this? Yep, there we go. Flag removed! We won! Good day, sir! Let's watch this amazing cutscene. Ah. <sighs> Is that the end of the level? Oh yeah. Are we still going on with this level? Yes, I like to save the game. Yes, I'm good. I'm so good right now. Wait, wait, uh... Yeah, this has been a uh, God of Duty Fun as Hell for the PlayStation 2. Daniel. Peace, hope you enjoyed this video and uh, let me know if I'm going to continue playing this game because I'm done recording for today even though I only recorded two Let's Play parts of this game. Yeah, just Everyone let me know if I'm going to continue. We had little idea the Nazi invasion had pushed and I'm just going to let this, uh, this cutscene play out. Might as well. Mm-hmm. The next day I was rescued by soldiers with the Red Army. I was 25. During my first skirmish, our squad was cut down, and I escaped into a collapsed building, where I took a sniper rifle off the body of a fallen comrade. My father's voice guided my aim as I cut down my first four Germans with that rifle. My skill was reported to HQ, and I was assigned as a sniper and sent to Stalingrad. I've been hunting Germans ever since. They took my family and my home, and I intend to take their lives. Tony Pavan, October 3rd, 1942, Stalin. Well, I'll leave this cutscene for next time, so yeah. Anyway, yeah, I'm done here, so goodbye. See you later, see you next video. Bees out, goodbye. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you later. Goodbye. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you later.